church, it's Amy Achoa, and as you know, Ridgecrest United Methodist Church has a long tradition of hosting Vacation Bible School during the summer on our campus for elementary children. But due to COVID-19, that just wasn't going to happen this year. And so the church staff and volunteers quickly adapted a Vacation Bible School outreach that could be done from home. So I thought it would be fun today if we spent some time unpacking the VBS kit that we sent home to all the participating families this summer. Uh, we will be having Vacation Bible School digitally online uh, June 1st through June 4th. Our program is four days long and we have gone with the theme of pool party, which is so appropriate for summertime. So let's unpack this VBS kit that went home with every family over the weekend. All right, um, on day one, we have diving board. And this baggie was filled with everything that families needed to do our day one program. So diving board relates to the Bible story of Jesus calling his first disciples and how it's like you have to get to that diving board and you're looking down at the water and you're not sure if you jump, but once you jump, you're all in. And that's what Jesus called of his disciples was to be all in once they took that leap of faith. So for our craft for day one, children were sent home egg cartons, empty egg cartons, not to make breakfast, but to instead um, go through and make little houses for all 12 disciples that Jesus called into ministry with him. So children will cut these out and then they'll make little houses for each of the disciples. And then on the other side of the disciples' house, they'll cut out the rest. And it is Jesus and his 12 disciples' song. And so we'll be going over that in the video that we've made for the day. And they'll plug that right there. And then they can just carry around their little disciple house and help them to remember about the diving board of the pool party and how Jesus calls us to jump right in. And then at the end of the day of all of our kits, we have end of day hoorays and they are just um, little goodie snacks. There's some nerds and then a little toy for the children. And we hope that children are able to get those at the end of their VBS day. Our content videos each day for Vacation Bible School last around 30 to 40 minutes. And so if they can sit through all of that, they'll have a very special treat at the end of the day. And also in the day one kit, we included the scripture story for the day for families to read again at home later in the day after VBS has ended or maybe stick to their refrigerators to help go back through the week to be reminded of our story. And then there's also a bunch of worksheets that children can do. There's coloring pages and mazes and um, other kinds of activities that they can work on during their VBS stay with us online. And one thing that we wanted to make sure we incorporated in our kits was um, stuff for the parents. And as you know, if you have attended our Vacation Bible Schools before, one of the highlights that we offer is a coffee cart to parents during drop-off. And since we couldn't do a coffee cart this time, we sent home coffee and creamer and sugar so that they can make their own coffee carts every day at home. There is nothing more important than a caffeinated parent. So we sent those in every day's kit. The second day of VBS is VBS water slide. There's no good pool party without the use of a water slide. And this story relates to Peter walking on water with Jesus. So Peter gets onto that water slide to get off the boat into um, the water with Jesus. And he's not too sure if he should do that. And he slides on down off the boat and jumps into the, splashes down into the water to start walking on water towards Jesus. Just like a water slide, you're fully splashed into that water. 
And so just the same as day one. Day two comes with a VBS packet of papers. We have the full scripture here for families to read through throughout the day or to hang up on their refrigerator. Uh, as you know, Jesus Walks on Water is a longer story, so they get two pages of scripture. And then it's followed by um, Peter Walks on the Water with Jesus, um, activity sheets and coloring pages for children to do during the video content section of our VBS day. And then one of my very favorite crafts to do with children is to make binoculars. And so during the craft day, children will be making binoculars. We've given um, stickers and ribbon to actually hold on to them. And they're gonna use these binoculars to look for Peter and Jesus walking on the water. And so day two, Peter and Jesus walk on water. For our third day, we have Marco Polo or water pool games. Um, Marco Polo is that game where the person who is it closes their eyes and yells, Marco! And then everyone else in the pool yells, Polo! And then the it has to go and find all of the polos with their eyes closed. And day three story is um, Jesus and the woman at the well, or the Samaritan woman, and how if you're thinking about Marco Polo, Jesus doesn't have to call out Marco and hear back Polo to know where we are and what we're all about. Um, we are already known and seen fully by him. And so for day three, again, we have our Bible story printout of the Samaritan woman or the woman at the well. And then along with, <laughs> she has to find them in this maze. And then along with our activities for the day. And then on Wednesday, the Wednesday craft is a little sippy cup that children can go and use and color and be reminded, just like in the story of the Samaritan woman, that Jesus is the living water. And so hopefully this will help remember that. And of course, every day ends with an end of day hooray, a special treat and toy as the children make it through their VBS day. And then our very last day of VBS is um, Cannonball. And as we know, all good pool parties, there's always someone who makes a cannonball and a big splash into the water. And that helps us remember our last day's theme, which is Romans 10, 9, confessing that Jesus is Lord. And so when you are um, confessing that you believe in Jesus and that he can forgive you of all of your sins, you want to make a huge splash for everyone to see and then feel that water on them from your splash, knowing that Jesus is Lord and you declare that in your heart. And so, as always, we have our VBS worksheets. Romans 10, 9 is a small scripture, but very mighty. <laughs> and we have that printed along with some worksheets to go along with Romans 10, 9. And then on this day, we've included a four-foot butcher paper for children to roll out and spread out all over the floor and to write that they declare that Jesus is Lord. And we encourage families to post these up in their front windows or on their garage doors um, so that children get the full effect of that cannonball splash into the water, declaring that Jesus is theirs and Jesus is their savior. And then, of course, end of day hooray it wouldn't be vbs without special treats and snacks and so there is one of these in every day uh, that's the four days of our vacation bible school for elementary age children and as we were thinking about how to make these vbs kits at home we decided to also recognize the other children that aren't in elementary school but are still in the family and so we asked this year for the names and ages of all children in the families and we decided to do something for each of them not just the ones who would be going through this vacation bible school week and so if there is a baby in the family one that is uh, too little to be in vbs yet we included a special bag just for them and in that bag we put hey there baby you are a vbs kid 
in training and we are looking forward to when you can join in on all the fun at VBS2. Enjoy your goodie bag that we packed just for you. Jesus loves you and so do we, your friends at RUMC. And so in every baby bag, we included some treats. We all know babies love treats. And so if mom or dad uh, is holding on to baby while helping their elementary age children, go through the day of VBS. Hopefully they can use these snacks to help make that baby happy while they sit there watching their older brothers and sisters go through VBS. And then we also included this super sweet Baby's First Bible Story book. It's a board book, so it's a little more durable. And it has different Bible stories and these big, vibrant photos for babies to look at and for parents and older siblings to read to them. And so we thought that was really sweet. And then if a family has a teenager, someone older than fifth grade in the family, we were sure to pack a bag for each of them as well. And in the bags, they have this little note. It says, hello there. You may have graduated out of Vacation Bible School, but we want you to know that we still think you are great and hope you have a fun summer. Be sure to check out all the things we've included in your bag and the club that we run at BHS called Cluster of Hope. Enjoy your goodie bag, your friends at RUMC. And so in each bag, we've included a devotion book. Um, this one is the one that I pulled to show you is one for a teenage boy, but we do have other ones for girls and also ones um, for older so the we have also we have three different styles of teenage books that we've given all appropriate content for who it's for and so this one's really cool because it goes through day by day regarding different types of um topics or circumstances so you can look those up also included in all of the teen bags are these super awesome uh, verse stickies and it's kind of like a calendar a day if you've ever seen one of those where you just pull them off and you have one for the next day and so these scriptures are pull off and then when you pull them off they're sticky so you can go and stick those verses wherever you want on your mirror in your bathroom or your parents windshield or maybe your younger siblings forehead <laughs> wherever you want to choose and then just like the end of day hooray goodie bags that we gave for all elementary age children we also were ensure to include different kinds of treats for the teenagers for each day. So there's four different kinds of treats, popcorn and all kinds of that for them to go through each day of VBS too. And one of the great parts of Vacation Bible School in a regular year is having our VBS volunteer party. And that's when all the volunteers get together and celebrate the end of Vacation Bible School and all the great things that have happened during the week. Well, that wasn't gonna happen this year. So we were trying to think of a way to celebrate the volunteers who are the parents this year, because it's the parents who are gonna be running the VBS program each day from home. And so what we came up with is um, coming up with a date night. And so what we did is we packed a bag for each mom and dad in um, the VBS participating families and we gave them all the ingredients that they need to have a really awesome movie date night. And so in the, <laughs> this is what's on the bag that's just for mom and dad. It says, hey there mom and dad, Psst, this is for you. And then inside it, just like the baby and the teenager have, it says, let me if I can get it right. Hey there, mom and dad. Thank you for investing in your children's faith development by registering them for RUMC's Vacation Bible School this summer and helping them through each day of VBS during this stay at home period. We felt you deserve some R&R, so we packed you everything you need to put together an awesome date night. All you have to do is put the kids to bed early, which we know is not an easy task. Know that you are seen, you are known, and you are deeply loved. Keep up the good work, your friends at RUMC. And so 
in that date night package, I don't have everything out, but we have a um, redemption code for a red box movie that they can pick up anywhere throughout town. So we gave them a free code for a free movie rental. And then we packed it with all kinds of snacks and lots of popcorn bags and sodas. And so everything that they hopefully could use for a fun movie date night. And then of course we packed in um, some prayer books for mom and dad to use and hopefully they can use these together because they both are relevant for our walks with Christ. And so that's it. That's uh, what went into our VBS kits this summer. And we tried our best to stick true to what we usually would put in to our vacation Bible schools if it was held in person. And we hope that all of the Vacation Bible School families who are participating this summer uh, really get to get together and grow in their love for God and help them understand that the church is still open even if the building is not. And we thank you, church, for your continued giving through the church during this time as we continue to do these awesome outreaches for the community even though the church building is closed. And so I hope that um, as we close this little video that you continue to pray for our community and our world through this time and especially pray for these VBS families who will be going through the four days of our VBS program that they feel the love of Christ and know that our UMC is here right there for them. So thank you for watching this video and I hope to see you all soon. Bye-bye.